we've got a new product. We're calling it the H2 dry tube. We call it a dry tube uh, because it's not immersed in water. The water gets pumped through it and uh, it just circulates itself. Gravity feeds it and the gas carries the water back up through. So it's pumping water through, pumping the gas up through the bubbler. Um, the nice thing about these is they eliminate the need for any uh, mounting in the container. They stay cooler because they're exposed to the air. Um, the water temperature itself doesn't even reach 110 degrees. Um, these are really nice and they're um, real adaptable. It's easy to connect as many as you want to one single bubbler. Um, and basically, this here torch, I don't know if you can see that flame very good, but um, is running on 150 watts. Um, this is a battery charger. It's running on this battery charger at about 12 amps at about 13 volts. Um, go ahead and burn a can for you, give you an idea. Um, obviously, I was playing with it a little bit. But, you know, this is, this is approximately 1.2 liters a minute. We're going to give you, we're going to show you in a second here. I just wanted to show you the fire. This is really great. Um, my main inspiration for this on YouTube was Smart Scarecrow. Um, he was a big inspiration for this project. Anyways, I'm going to blow out this flame. Um, get out my timer. I'm not trying to cheat. Okay, start the timer. Lift that up. Oops, I didn't start the timer. Clear. Oops. Timer. Clear. Okay, here we go. Ready? And up and start. Hopefully I don't drop my iPod in the water. Um, at, uh, 20 seconds. Each mark indicates a half a liter. Turn that where everybody can see. 32 seconds. We're at 40 seconds. Forty-two seconds. Forty-four. Fifty seconds to make one liter. A minute to make one and a half liters. I need a more accurate amp meter. I mean, I'm pretty close. So, we're going to have two liters. And approximately one minute and 40 seconds, if you can see that water level down there. 140 for two liters. 
at approximately 12 amps at 13 volts. The cell is cool enough for me to hold on tight. Um, the water is cooler than the cell. And there you go. There you have it.